It has now been more than a week since former Arizona mom Lori Vallow violated a court order up in Idaho. She failed to show up to prove to authorities her two missing kids are alive. The kids, JJ and Tylee, have been missing since last September. And so police say Lori abruptly left in the middle of their investigation with her new husband, who is a doomsday book author, and they are up in Hawaii right now. We sent Kim Powell, our reporter. She's been following the story and she's live in Kauai tonight. Kim, is there any sign of them on the island right now? Well, we only found one person who has seen the couple once since Saturday. Now, we're not able to get into that private community where they've been living for the last two months, but every time we've driven by, we've noticed the curtains are shut and the lights are off. Family tells us Kauai is Lori Vallow's favorite place, so it's no surprise she ended up on the island with her new husband, Chad Daybell, avoiding police confrontation as they desperately search for her missing kids, 7-year-old JJ and 17-year-old Tylee, who have been missing since September. Police in Arizona, Idaho and Hawaii have served multiple search warrants to find any sign of the kids. In Rexburg, Idaho, a storage unit contained all of their toys. In Kauai, police didn't find any evidence that the kids were ever with the couple on the island, prompting a court order for Lori to return to the mainland to prove JJ and Tylee were okay, and she never showed up. There are three deaths surrounding this couple that are all under investigation, including Lori's husband, Charles Vallow, her brother, Alex Cox, who shot him, and Chad Daybell's previous wife, Tammy. Court paperwork shows that Charles became worried about JJ's safety because Lori became obsessed with believing she was a god and needed to prepare people for the end of the world. Chad is an author of several doomsday books. People who live near the couple in a private resort in Princeville say they haven't seen them in days. Kauai police say they can't do anything until Idaho authorities give them the okay. And police say Lori has not cooperated in helping them find her missing kids. In fact, she lied to police about where JJ is. The next move, whatever it is, is up to a judge in Idaho. For now, it is just a waiting game to see what happens next. For now, live in Kauai, I'm Kim Powell for Arizona's Family.